Pretty well, close, huh? Three out of four. Three out of four ain't bad. <laughs> no, no. Pound to fit, paint to match. Yeah, yeah, we're doing good. What are we doing today, Mike? She's going in. Going in, step one. Yeah, I sure hope so. It goes in with no complications. We got her, we got her barrier coated all the way up to the blue and then uh, bottom paint down to here i just i didn't want to paint bottom paint the whole thing just so people keep their hands off the bottom paint and stuff like that and once we get this settled in got a few little items to take care of and then the motor will follow so about two days this today two more days maybe the motor maybe I'm tomorrow think, i'm thinking no the motor won't go tomorrow okay you got a day's worth of work probably at least a day's okay. work of mountain foundations and just little things like that and then uh Beta, it's going to be Beta Wednesday. Beta Wednesday. Beta Wednesday. All right. Okay. Let's, let's go do it. It's all painted and cleaned and ready. We're going to put an engine in. What do you think? I like it. <laughs> it's an exciting day. Get the leg in here. It's looking good. Single drive first. And as Mike Schweitzer said, it's going to be either real easy or it's gonna be a real pain in the ass. <laughs> so, we said plan for pain in the ass and if it's easy, we'll be happy. Here we go. Once we get it rigged, I'm gonna go up top and prop it up. Go ahead, Justin, roll that underneath the Straight under the pick point there. Mike will clip it on. Right there. You know what the first thing you do? Check that shack. <laughs> Might as well just hang out and watch. Okay. We're tight here. Alright. This is the cribbing to you gonna help? If you need some help, let me know what to do. We always need help. I think it's gonna take two two people up inside the boat. Do I think we'll take up all the slack again? Yep. Yeah. Is that thing locked so it won't freewheel? Not yet. Because, you know, it wouldn't start freewheel until we got her about 10 feet yeah, in the air. Well, <laughs> yeah, probably bounced pretty good. That's got a that big ring. I think it would. Okay, uh, take her up. Up, up, up. Up, up, up. I'm watching your top. You're good. Okay. You just watch. Don't let me ram the side of the hall. Say again. Keep an eye on just the stinger in the hall. Here we go. Yeah, I'll take the bottom off. Yeah, just take the bottom off. Hold on. 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 Those are some good looking coveralls. Oh man, they glow in the dark. Damn. Wait, it glows in the dark? Yes. What? Bring it in here. I can lift it. Come down. Come down a little bit. Here. 
Good call, Justin. Okay, now come forward and uh, start to your right. You're good, there. Coming forward. And to the surgeon set. Yep. A little bit. Keep on going, keep on going. Okay. Now Twizzler down. Get the leg to the bottom. Like yeah. Careful, the lips are You can go down a little more if you want. Go One second, though. You ready? You ready? Yeah. yeah. You can come down another foot, probably. Yeah. Want to go right down until we hit the chain. Okay, down right there. That's good. Yeah. No, it's chain fall. Problem is, is that we need to. There's no problems, Chris. Trust me. <laughs> what about this? How are we gonna get this past this lift? Oh, it's a cake. <laughs> Just turn it sideways. Just turn it sideways. Yeah. Um, All right. We are gonna have to rotate this down. It's gonna be probably just unhook it and get a couple of people in here. Uh huh. Because we've got to, you know, it's got to be tipped back quite a ways to get this yeah. through the hole. Okay. The only way we're going to do that is to get this bracket off of it. It's not that terribly heavy. No. So we're going to have to let it down. Um, and we might just put it right here. Let's see. I don't want to set it on any studs, so. Yeah. Go ahead and let's do this. I have that bridge that goes across there too. If you want. No, that's all right. I'm just going to set it right in this hole right here. I think. Yep. Now you gotta come up and we're on a ball. There we go. Okay, now we gotta get it straight. Get a hold of it. Okay, you clear? So I think it's there. Okay. Yeah, they're like there, we need a little rubber mallet. I think so. And a stick of wood. How about if somebody went down and grabbed that cell leg and kind of wiggled it around? No, I can wiggle this. It's the ring. It's, it's the ring. It's yeah. the okay. ring, yeah. This one's binding on this side. This one's binding on this side. This one's we just need a we just plastic need, hammer. Yeah, yeah. Just plastic start hammer with a tap. Yeah, it just needs some persuasion. Would you like them? Yeah, we need some. Okay. Just like that, clean and installed, it fits. If it fits, yeah, it sails. <laughs> Good work. Thank you. Thank you. Good work. Are you happy? You. I'm happy. Yeah. Looks like he was always there. Yeah. Oh yeah, you've got Three fingers are better at tip clearance. Let's see, on the low 10, you got two inches. Eight, you got 20 per 25%. That's good. Perfect. Sail drive is in. And Mike's got it cribbed up here, getting ready for the new engine. But as we said, there's some other things. So we got the water lift muffler in and secured and mounted. And now we're gonna work on the battery tray and a fuel line running up over my shoulder. And we're going to put in a, a stripping port on the tank to get down in that low spot, make sure there's no water in here, and then we'll put the engine in tomorrow. Plenty to do today. And we probably need to get this exhaust hose also routed up and through and to the transom to that new fitting. So, plenty to do. 
Welcome to the Scallywags, located in the beautiful Pacific Northwest, where Skagit Valley College has been training technicians since 1968. If you are looking for industry certification and the skills to work in maritime, this is the place to visit. Our staff will share so much knowledge and experience, you will not be disappointed. The workforce demand is very high and all of our graduates are working around the world. If this sounds interesting to you, schedule a tour and come check us out.